Victorville, California, Manson, the Master Blaster Gibson against Clifton Brown for the IKKC World Cruiserweight Championship. And now Gibson, while we were away, took off uh, those red trunks and the uh, navy blue long pants and uh, went with the black, black trunks with the uh, zebra stripe on down the side. And, you know, I'll tell you, I'm surprised that the referee hasn't warned uh, Clifton Brown from grabbing the foot because grabbing is not really allowed to be grabbing the foot. Got the name Master Blaster years ago for having blasted so many masters. <laughs> and he's proud of that too, Blinky. He's had a long and storied career. Used to fight on the undercards of Don Wilson, Benny the Jet Bukitas, Eves, uh, John Eves from Ontario, Dennis Alexio. He's been around the sport a long time. There's no question. Switching back and forth, orthodox and orthodox, and southpaw one minute. Spinning oh, back and forth. And then the glove of Clifton Brown. Clif Clifton looking to load up on that right leg, Phil. You can see that that's the shot he's looking for right now. They're going to grab the load. There's a jump kick, but Manson keeps him off with putting a defensive heel kick out there. Oh, Manson. Uh, holding that white leg of, uh, of Brown and thus far, Mark Zacharotis has, uh, has not moved in to stop Manson from doing it. Here's that side kick, left kick by Manson Gibson. And a good shot was also on the right kick by the right knee of Clifton Brown. Both fighters looking to establish their dominance here. Gibson found a place for that shot. Gibson tipped the scales last night when he hit 184 pounds. Three days ago, he weighed 203. Told me, though, losing the uh, 19 pounds. Uh, not affected him whatsoever. Felt real strong. But two down, three up. I think the fight's really going to start taking some shape now, Phil. Both fighters have been measuring each other. And as you look right here, you see Clifton Brown trying to come in. And then just the awkwardness. You see that kick. There's that left hook that, that, that Manson Gibson. He throws the front kick. It's grabbed. The counter, there's a spinning back fist there by Manson. And, he, and here you have an attempted jump kick, but Manson just sticks a defensive heel kick out there and throws the momentum of Clifton Brown off. There's that another left hook. You know, Manson's landed three, four good left hooks right on the on the head of, of Clifton Brown, Phil. And you know what? Clifton takes a tremendous shot. Don't hesitate. Now be Gibson first. does not appear to be, be any first, of the worst for wear. Now, Blinky started in this sport back in the uh, in the early 80s. He's been at this a long, long time. Talking last night about Carter Perryman taught him how to fight in Chicago's Southside projects. And today he's all about trying to teach what Perry taught him. And that is the discipline of uh, kickboxing and also to love the sport. Really embrace the sport. You see Manson trying to deliver that back kick, and, and don't, don't kid yourself. That back kick that Manson gets to throw, he hits you with the heel of the foot, and he does big damage with it. Clifton Brown 
on the right. He's the taller of the two fighters. Anson Gibson in the, uh, in the red gloves. And you can really see the plan of Clifton Brown. He wants to punish the legs. And there's a right leg, right hand. But then he walks into a counter hook by Manson. But there, there goes the knees for him. There's another right leg, right hand by Clifton. This fight's heating up for him. Uppercut by, by uh, Brown. Left knee to the body, right leg to the leg. And it's on now. And here you see Manson trying to keep him off with that left leg. There's a right leg, right hand that really, really was, was the, the starting point of this frenzy because you see Clifton Brown begin to jump, jump knees to the head and to the body as he's got Manson Gibson there, another right leg, right hand. And those are big shots, Phil. Those got bad intention. And we see the knees. 